The epic struggle of the Greek Revolution was the culmination of a series of premature uprisings which, as a rule, ended tragically. It can be seen as the end of a process set in motion by the Enlightenment and the revolutionary ideas of the time. For almost a full decade, from 1821 to 1829, the Greeks and their essentially ragtag army were pitted against the well-organized, numerically superior, and better equipped Ottoman military. They also had to contend with the hostility of the major European powers intent on maintaining the status quo and preventing the breakup of the Ottoman Empire. In the early years of the revolution, the fighting spirit of the Greeks managed to bring about the desired results on land and at sea. After 1824, however, the struggle was undermined by weak political leadership, internal conflicts, and the reorganization of the enemy forces. Despite the obstacles and adversities, however, the revolution continued, and it stirred international public opinion. The decision of the Europeans to support the Greeks in their struggle the election of Ioannis Kapodistrias by the Third National Assembly in the spring of 1827, and the naval victory of the great powers over the Turkish-Egyptian fleet at Navarino in October of that year, marked the beginning of the end of the revolution and the declaration of independence of the new Greek state. <laughs>